Hello, this is Piedra Luna. This is a collective message for today, for the energies of today. Um, and today I'm using the Tao Oracle. I'll put a link on on my YouTube, on the description below. If not, you can find it on my Amazon wish list. For today, the number energy is six. Six is about relationships. And the message that I'm getting and... Uh, well, I'm not surprised because today, planetary influences, we have, and today is Tuesday, Martes, which is the day of Mars, uh, the influence of, uh, the planet, of, of the planet Mars. Uh, there's probably, I don't know if it, in English there's the same saying, but in Spanish we have a saying, uh, don't get married and don't sail on a Tuesday because it's bad luck because it's the day of Mars. And Mars represents conflict, wars, um frictions, uh, confrontations, so, and Mars right now is on, on the sign of Libra, Libra being the diplomat, Libra being uh, the sign that wants everybody to, to be happy, likes to see the angle of everything so that everything is fair, is uh, basically uh, Libra is the sign of justice, right? So Libra likes a lot of balance and is very delicate, but once we have the conjunction of these two uh, two opposing energies today of Mars and Libra it's um, basically like having a rhino in a crystal store right that's the approach of, of Mars Mars is not about being diplomat uh, but <clears throat> sorry the message for today exactly because of that is telling us that it's very like well not very like it's very possible it's very possible that today we might have conflicts with our family in the workplace and what the energy is telling us here with the with the um i also use the synchro signs which are, are the ones that you're uh, seeing here i i like them very much more than oracles i don't know they resonate a lot with me and they always uh coincide with my readings so what it, the energy is telling us today is keeping still Meditation, self-renewal, composure, detachment, self-acceptance, self equanimity, and serenity. And if you see this drawing here, that's exactly, I mean, oh my God, yeah, basically the image of, of the Buddha here and of this person here as well, and this is, that's exactly where it fell, uh, means exactly that. Today is a time to meditate. Today is a time not to take anything personal, especially in the workplace, because that's what I, where I feel there might be conflicts. Um, just take it easy. Don't take anything personal, because today especially is a day of irritation that we're probably going to uh, uh, snap back at people at work. And instead of... Uh, creating good boundaries because there's moments and times where we have to be uh, serious and, and put our boundaries out there so that people don't think they can walk uh, over us. But today, today's the day to to uh, bite our tongues and uh, to, of course, that doesn't mean we're not, if something happens today, we're not going to address it. Uh, but the the recommendation is not to address it today because today the energy is very strong. And as well, we still have the influence of uh, the full moon, which was yesterday on Pisces. So uh, we can feel like overly sensitive, like people are, maybe they told us something that they didn't mean in a wrong way and we take it the wrong way. So that's the recommendation that also this uh, feeling of friction of, uh, and discomfort, I see that is coming from... And here I'm gonna show you. This is uh, like the rainbow and 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 the mountain. So this and this is a map. Uh, here, this other card says the gentle penetrating a soft approach, faith, moderation, a subtle but deep influence, understanding, and nonviolence. And I also got us like what were the recommendations? How um, can we get out of this? Um, strong conflicting energy and the card that i got is strength and again this is also uh the similar energy strength is about being having a gentle approach uh to accomplishing whatever we want to accomplish and to have and also i mean the strength card is not also is not only like to be um 
uh, have like a soft approach to things and a compassionate approach to others, but also to have a compassionate approach to ourselves and to um, tame the lion within. If you feel like today is a day that the lion in you wants to get out and bite everybody's heads off, just be calm, just center yourself, don't take anything personal. Today is not a day to put boundaries. Uh, if you need to put boundaries, then don't do it today, do it later when you're not feeling hot-headed and frustrated because what I also feel here in the on the rest of the energies I also got this card well let me finish with the with the signs first with the synchro signs here we have the one the one is about like miracles the the point the center is about getting to our center of ourselves of uh, knowing our power and not feeling like because people irritate us uh, we are powerless uh, not to fall into that trap like this on this uh, web here not to fall in that trap of uh, feeling like you're trapped and everything irritates you and you act in a negative way and that's going to add more um, of course negativity and more friction to already a situation where you're feeling uncomfortable so this again could be like a relationship but mm, it kind of feels like it's more like in the workplace um, but you will know it, what resonates with you if it's your family settings or your relationships with your, with your family or it can be all our romantic relationships or work relationships it could be anything or a project that that you are um trying to accomplish uh the like the uh, feeling of of uh, discomfort that i feel it's like kind of like the uh general energy for today i have the two of wands which is about making decisions and i also have the five of cups which is it says i will move forward when the time is right this also, this card it says standstill, alienation, a stalemate, extagnation, withholding, grinding to a halt, insensi insensitivity, and mistrust. So it's part of that energy of feeling trapped in something, probably trapped in a relationship, trapped in the economical situation, trapped in a job. And what this card is telling us is not to, de not to fall to desperation and to frustration because we're not going to find a way out of this situation if we're in that energy. And that today is maybe not the day to make any decisions. Uh, the astrological information for today is... Uh, giving us a recommendation as to not make any impulsive decisions today. Uh, so yes, you might have a feeling that you want to move forward from something, but today is not the day to make those kind of decisions. Today is a day to go within and to go more like in the hermit mode and not to let anybody like... Uh, uh, affect you. Uh, don't take anything personal. Don't get into any conflicts, especially in the workplace. Um, if you disagree with someone, then maybe today is not the day to address it. You might be able to address it on at the end of the week. Um, I also see that, and here I have, the, if it wasn't enough, I think, um, this this is a chain and and two, and the hands are chained so you're inside you you're basically chained up to something and that's how you're feeling and that is creating a lot of frustration in a lot of us um could be just like the global uncertainty and we feel like we're in, on lockdown that our uh choices are restricted but today as i said is a day not to thread in the negative, not to thread on the things that are not going right, because uh, Mars is is uh, ready to pick up a fight with any frustration that he feels, and <clears throat> Libra is going to have a hard time uh, controlling Mars, that it will say things in a diplomatic way. Um, I also pulled some p poker playing cards to see what, what was the energy. I, I really like using uh, regular playing cards as well. And again, I see here, this is the Two of Pentacles, which is about decisions, which is very similar to the to the uh, energy of Two of Wands, which is, uh, do I stay with the old or do I go with the new? And the Seven of Cups is about options. So this, again, is a theme that uh, we're... We want to decide that we want something different and we're checking out for the different options and we're checking out what is best for us. And again, it could be relationship wise, like romantic, or it could be work, uh, especially with the six of pentacles, which is where are we, uh, that decision of, of where are we going to invest our energies, where are we going to invest our lives, our money, whatever, our emotions. And, uh, 
so today is a day to figure out what is it that we really want without making any decisions because as i said today is not a day for decisions and the last card that i got is the ace of swords which i've been getting a lot of ace of swords um yesterday and the day before and the ace of swords is about the ultimate truth the cutting truth the reality getting getting to the bottom of it and um, i asked okay so how are we gonna get to the bottom of it or how what is going to be the key uh this day to feel or to guide us as to what is the best decision for us or or what is the best best method uh to um to decide or to make decisions and the cards that i got are the following okay, let me move here the uh camera hope i don't make you dizzy okay so we have this ones we have the strength, we have the queen of cups, and we have the wheel, as well as the three of wands. And for me, what this says, I mean, with relation to the rest of the energy that we have for today, for the recommendations and the influences of the planets, is to take it easy, to have a... a um, compassionate approach to everything even to people that are acting out i mean have some compassion uh, that doesn't mean i mean don't let them disrespect you of course but don't get into like a full confrontation with anybody um feel compassion for others that are and for yourself as well i mean it's not easy to go through a pandemic and we're all feeling the stress uh fi financial and the stress of losing loved ones and the stress of the uncertainty of the economy and the stress of being locked down and not being able to see our family members and and everything right so um just have a compassionate approach to yourself be compassionate in yourself that you have achieved a lot don't be so hard on yourself don't be so hard on other people with this two cards again the queen of cups is the ultimate compassionate queen she works from her heart uh she also makes decisions about her life on what resonates most resonates most with her heart and so the energy is is this just trying to get into a med meditative energy as much as you can to detach from mm, the earthly things that are causing you friction and just to focus your mind that again as the as the energy of, of the other readings of that this too shall pass and know that the wheel will t will turn but most likely the wheel would turn when you relax when you relax and we, when you let things flow and when you accept that nothing is permanent and that you will find a way that the universe will find a way for you and have confidence that that things will work out for you and that you will find a solution and that don't be too hard on yourself and thinking that you need to find a solution in one day or don't overwork yourself if you're working on a project think that you're gonna have the the whole project finalized in one day or one week just take it easy things will come in an organic way the wheel will turn but what is most important is that you will get whatever is it that you want uh as sooner if you calm down if you meditate if you take it easy if you just take one day at a time and uh and just wait for things to a better future is coming for all of us and and of course that doesn't mean we don't need to do the work but that doesn't mean we need to finish a kingdom in one day or sort all our problems in one day so today just take it easy relax go to your center uh don't mule or don't um um, overthink of the things that are making you feel like you're chained up in life or like uh, you're in a standstill or a stalemate, whatever it is and whatever kind of relationship it is with others. And uh, just, just take it easy. And remember, um, if there's any conflict today, remember my words. Today is Tuesday. Mars is on the house of Libra. And so there, there could be conflicts. So just don't Try not to get involved in them. I hope that was of help to you. Blessings to you all. And have a nice Tuesday.